Well, there's Oops. a cyclone coming yes. in to hit us in a, tonight in in about 10 hours time. Yeah. So, so roads are closed. Yeah. So closing. guys, there's a cyclone coming from the north and it's hitting the coast about 150 kilometers west of us. So we're inland at the moment yeah. and we've got to go further inland. Because they're closing the caravan park we're staying in now. We sort of seek shelter here yesterday just to just to be somewhere where there's people and water and stuff and it's really windy now it's not nothing you know but it's quite windy and a bit rainy and stuff and then and they've they're closing the, they've just told us now they're closing the caravan park at 12 o'clock midday in three hours so time we've got to move on so we've got to move on east to get away from the <coughs> cyclone yeah. so we're gonna have a shower and then we're gonna <laughs> move on it's bizarre. We didn't even want to be in a caravan park, but no, yeah. and and we didn't want to go this far east at all. We no. wanted to go. So now we're going to be tourists in Mount Magnet. Mount Magnet, which yeah. is safe apparently, and it's completely full. This like all the caravan parks, everything's full. So we probably have to stay on side on the side on of the road. Yeah. Who knows? Who knows when stay. we get there? <laughs> We've landed. We're in in another Mount, caravan park. <laughs> Mount Mount Magnet, whatever. There's somebody over there. They're lovely. They're from, from Dutchland, from Holland, and um, and the, we're away from the cyclone. It's well, quite yeah. windy. It's quite windy over there. I don't know if you can see the the, the clothes flying in the wind. Anyway, lots of flies, of course. Lots of Even wind. More flies? Even more flies. Lovely. But tomorrow we might be able to go back towards the coast because oh, nobody it? knows nobody knows everybody's panicking there's no well, bloody anything I don't know. it's probably a hoax it's probably <laughs> fake news fake news never happened <laughs> the road that we want to cross but it, everything's been closed because of the cyclone yesterday so the road is closed so all these cars and vans or whatever they're waiting for the road to open <laughs> it's not because it's a busy town it's because it's the not. roads are closed it's busy with flies though however yeah. well we know that we know that people are bored of hearing about the flies now. <laughs> that's right there's just a lot of them but anyway so we might be going to the local museum, but right now the Telstra network is down. We can't get money out of the bank because there's no network. And we might not even be able to pay at the at the uh, at the museum. museum. So it's all fun and games. Anyway, let's hope that it's all going to open soon. The road is now open to Perth and to Galton and all the trucks love it. They've been waiting here for two days. They are going crazy. And then it just continues and continues and continues. It's beautiful. Oh, no. It's part of the 
It's like being in Copenhagen Airport where they've got these two women standing up there looking out. Oh. And this is our van parked up here on a on the gutter sort of excess hill. And somebody very butch is changing the oil. How good is that? There you go. Dripping out. Right, I'm bored now. I'm bored now, should I just close it up? You can't leave it because I don't know what to do. <laughs> Still standing. The old buildings seem to have done okay here. Yeah. Oh, look at it's a nice little town, a bit of damage. Look at that. Oh shit. Oh, and that's oh, all the roofs come off. It's completely ruined. Isn't that lovely? 